I'm Adam DeMarco. And I'm Atticus Mitchell. And you're watching Shine On Media. Congratulations on tonight. Thank you. Very are, are you nervous to see yourselves on the big screen? I'm nervous to see him on the big screen. I'm nervous to see me on the big screen. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's going to... How do you think it's going to go? I think it's going to go very well. Um, I'm not in it all that much. He is mostly in it, but he killed it. Everybody killed it. He's in it a lot. Yeah. Have you seen it? I've seen it, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> see, don't try to stop me. I, I haven't seen any. <laughs> I, I don't know what's going to happen. We haven't happen. seen it. I'm nervous, yeah. It's just like the fear of the uh, unknown, so... <laughs> So obviously she's a DJ in this movie. What would your DJ names be if you were DJ? I'd be DJ Rickata. Rickata? No, that wouldn't be my real name. You do one. Um, that would be Ian. Sorry. I don't know. I'd be like Funkmaster Supreme or something. Nobody could stop me. That would be. That's a good name. Funkmaster. It's very generic, but you know, I only had two seconds to answer, so I had to think of something. I just remembered the writer of the book. Her name is Danielle Joseph. Her initials are DJ. That's crazy. My name would be, first thing that comes to mind, DJ Dolphin Swimmer. I don't know what that means. I think it's good. I don't know what that means. And it looks, obviously there's a lot of behind the scenes footage online. You guys jamming out, having a lot of fun. Did you actually get any work done? No. You, you've seen the movie, did yeah. we? No, but I mean. It, was like, it doesn't look like we got work done. I feel like, it, like in your two minutes that you weren't goofing off. We were reluctant to get the work done. We we're like, can we just play the song? Yeah. Fine, we'll go do the movie. Okay. Whatever. We'll, we'll act for you. Like, this that's, is live, like that's a thing. This is live music. Whatever. What's better than live music? Nothing. Nothing. Is the answer music. correct? Nothing. No. In this movie, the twins do a lot of crazy things to try to, you know, figure out who she is, impress everybody. Have you ever done anything crazy to impress a girl? Pardon? Have you ever done anything crazy to impress a girl? To impress a girl? You have. Tell them your prom story. Well, I don't know if you've ever heard of prom proposal, but it's basically you asking a girl out to prom in a very special way. And my way was extremely special. I was in a play. She was in the front row. There was curtain call. Bruno Mars started playing. I had roses. I went down in front of 500 people and I asked her. And she said no, I'm kidding. She said yes, which was nice. <laughs> I would have never told that story if she said no, but she said yes. That's my crazy impress a girl story. And it worked. What advice do you have for overcoming shyness? A uh, what? For overcoming shyness. Oh. I think uh, just it, it's a hard thing to do. It's so first hard. of all, um, for me, it was just coming into accept, just accepting, just accepting who I am as a person, and overcoming shyness is just being. I think just being confident in yourself and who you are, which is kind of the message of this movie, also. Yeah. And why would you tell everybody to tune into Radio Rebel? Everybody tune into Radio Rebel. That's why. Do, do it now. Just because. Just, just, just do because. it. 